Hello, SFMMP vendors. Thank you for tuning in to the 2024 Oklahoma Senior Farmers Market Nutrition Program, or SFMMP, training. In this video, you will learn more about the history of SFMMP, how SFMMP works at the market, and our 2024 season timeline. Let's get started with the program history. The Federal Senior Farmers Market Nutrition Program began in 2001. Each state must apply to receive funding. The state of Oklahoma began operating the program in 2009. States must have at least 80% utilization to apply for more funding. We successfully met this threshold in our first year operating the program online in 2022. In 2024, Oklahoma increased program funding from 75,000 to 175,000 to distribute among seniors. This has increased our goals for service in 2024 to 4,000 participants statewide. Let's talk more about the process. To participate in SFMMP, a senior must apply annually. Guidelines for the program are as follows. Income must be at or below 185% of the federal poverty line, age of 60 years or older, or 55 plus if Native American, and the senior must live within 30 miles of a participating market. Once the senior is approved, they will be mailed their SFMMP card. The card is preloaded with $50 to be used by November 30th, 2024. Note the application will soft open on March 15th and active recruitment and promotion will begin April 1st. Cards will begin to be mailed by Oklahoma Human Services the first week of May. To use SFMMP benefits at the market, a senior will visit the Info or Market Manager booth with their SFMMP card. They will give the market manager the amount they want to spend and they will swipe the card, enter their PIN, and be given the amount of tokens for the amount swiped. Eligible vendors will be identified by the SFMMP sign at their booth and the senior will select eligible food items to purchase with their token. Vendors take note. You cannot provide change for tokens or charge sales tax on the selected item. If the tokens are not equal to the item value, you should round down the price or add to the purchase to make it equal to the exact dollar amount. Eligible items to be purchased with SFMMP benefits are Oklahoma grown fruits and vegetables, fresh cut herbs, and raw honey. It is very important to ensure your market staff and vendors are in compliance with program rules and regulations. Throughout the market season, unidentified seniors and other individuals may visit to test program compliance. They will have an OHS-issued card and will try to purchase ineligible items. If a vendor or market has continued infractions, eligibility to continue participating in the program can be jeopardized. Now that we have a better understanding of program rules, process, and compliance, let's discuss our timeline for the 2024 SFMMP season. Beginning with today, February 15th, with the launch of online training for vendors, market managers, and recruiters. The initial deadline for recruiters to complete the training is March 15th. We will soft open the application on March 15th. This is the earliest date to begin submitting applications for seniors. This is also the deadline to share recruitment events with ONI staff. April 1st marks the official launch of the 2024 SFMMP application. This is when active recruitment, communication, and promotion will begin. The application launch postcard will be mailed to past participants and those on the waitlist with information on market days and hours, as well as sign-up events and recruiter contact information. On May 1st, Oklahoma Sen Human Services will begin mailing SFMMP cards. We will have a new feature on the website to allow recruiters and participants to view the mailed on date online. Remember, farmers and vendors must be trained to accept program benefits. ONI staff will begin market visits in April. Please ensure that your vendors are trained by the time cards start to be used at markets in May, so make sure you complete the quiz at the end of this video to be marked as trained. The expiration date has been slightly extended this season. Program benefits will expire on November 30th. Just some data from our past participants 99% of participants surveyed recommend the program. Some benefits they've enjoyed are quality of food, ability to extend their food budget, improved nutrition and diet, friendly people and staff at the markets, 
and supporting local farmers in Oklahoma. Now, how to address concerns related to the program. Markets and farmers should report any attempts of program abuse by participants, such as trying to sell or exchange food purchased with tokens, requesting cash for EBT cards, using empty EBT cards, being abusive towards market employees, and so on. Complaints will be handled by DHS Adult and Family Services. USDA prohibits discrimination based on race, color, national origin, sex, disability, age, or reprisal or retaliation for prior, prior civil rights activity conducted or funded by USDA. Allegations of discrimination or other violation of civil rights will be made to DHS. The civil rights administrator handles the grievance. To file a program complaint of discrimination, complete the USDA program discrimination complaint form found online at Office of the Assistant Secretary for Civil Rights and at any USDA office or write a letter addressed to USDA and provide in the letter all of the information requested in the form. To request a copy of the complaint form, call 866-632-9992, submit your completed form or letter to USDA by mail, fax, or email to the contacts listed below. A few final reminders. Every market manager, recruiter, and vendor must complete a training. If you hold multiple roles, such as a market manager and vendor, you only need to complete training for one of the roles. If you hold an in-person training at your market, please take attendance and send ONI the list of vendors that attended so we can mark them as trained. Only trained markets and vendors can accept SFMP benefits. Applications are available starting March 15th and active recruitment will begin on April 1st. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to ONI or Oklahoma Human Services. Technical assistance and additional resources are available at oklac.org help. Thank you for your support this season. We truly appreciate your role in the Senior Farmers Market Nutrition Program. Submit the quiz below to complete the training.